Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another video and guess what I'm doing again? That's right, I'm trading a bunch of shit to GameStop again and I have a few things here that I'm trading. What am I trading towards? I'm actually trading towards credit to get both Pokemon, Sun or Moon, whatever one I decide at the time. And for Black Friday. Black Friday is next week, and GameStop actually has a f quite a few things that I actually want. And I've been trading in a lot of stuff. I traded in before for the PSVR, and I had a few things I wanted to trade, and I did, and I got the PSVR solely on things that I traded in. And I traded in quite a bit of stuff. D don't get me wrong, I have tons of shit. <laughs> I still have over 600 360 games. So it's not like I'm dwindling down on my collection. But uh, I did get quite, I, I got rid of quite a few things. And guess what I'm doing? Again, I'm getting rid of some things again. So let's get to it. Okay? Um, I'm going to make this quick, okay? Because I actually have to go. Because GameStop closes in like 30 minutes. Um, so let's, uh, like an hour. But by the time I get there, it'll be 30 minutes. But anyway, let's get to it. First thing is a PS3 controller. I actually have two of these. This is my second one. Uh, I got rid of one of these before. I don't know if it was for the last trade-in video or it was one from earlier this year. I, I don't think I did a video for earlier this year, but they had a sale that was similar earlier this year. Um, that was like 50% extra credit, so I did it. I don't think I did a video for that, but uh, I'm trading in another one. This is like a $21 thing right here. Oh, by the way, I didn't even mention, there is a deal going on right now. If you trade towards the new Pokemon, you get 40% extra credit, uh, included with your 10%, so you're pretty much getting 50% extra credit. Um, so that's why I'm doing it, and that's why I'm getting Pokemon. Originally, I wasn't going to get it, but I have some stuff that I can get rid of for a decent price, so screw it. I'm going to get that and have some extra money for Black Friday. But anyway, this one goes for about $21. This is a Wii U Pro controller, which I think I tried to... I tried to sell in my last video. I think I showed it like I was getting rid of it. And I went to there and they wouldn't take it without a cord that charges it, which made sense. I don't know why I didn't bring it. Even though they take PS3 controllers without the cord, which is weird. But, um, yeah. They, um, well, at least I remember them taking it before. Hopefully they take it now. <laughs> but anyway, I have tons of these cords, so maybe I should try to find one of them. But, uh, yeah, anyway, I'm trading this in. This is like another, this is like 20 five dollars or something like that something weird it's like it's pretty pricey but the thing is that these controllers are going down in value the white ones at least the black ones are still like forty dollars but the white ones are going down to around 25 30 new so and also i don't play my wii u so <laughs> might as well get rid of it if i do play my wii u i'll just play with the wii u controller it's fine with me um next is yoshi's woolly world uh just a disc only it's like twenty dollars i can sell it for i think i bought it for like 20 30 so i'm got i'm taking a little loss on this but I played it, and so did my cousin, and that's the only reason why I got it, is because my cousin really wanted it, and I wanted to play it too. Wii Sports, uh, I have a bunch of these, so I'm going to get rid of this one. Only like five bucks, but whatever, it adds to it. Um, Twisted Metal, uh, this is another like five dollars maybe. Um, the only reason why I'm getting rid of this is because I thought for some reason I had it sealed, which is not worth anything anyway, but if it was sealed, then I would have definitely kept it, just in case it becomes valuable in the future but it's not sealed so screw it divinity original sin this game i've started over like maybe three or four times and every time i played it i really enjoyed it but uh i never could get into it i'm not a big rpg fan i'm definitely not big into uh classic rpgs like this is uh, i'm not saying i'm i don't like them i'm just not big into them so when i play 10 hours i'm like yeah i'm good i don't need to play another 200 hours of this uh that's usually what happens with this game and this is about 20 bucks so get rid of it mortal kombat xl getting rid of this they're giving me 22 i think that's good enough i'm gonna get rid of that Woo. recore never played this guy i don't even know why i got it. to be fair i got it for like 25 bucks i had like some credit when i uh it came out so i did get this for cheapish and they're selling it for around 23 24 so i'm taking a loss but whatever i'm never playing this i don't know why i bought it really i was excited to play it at first and then i saw the reviews and then i had other games to play i think it came out the same day as some other game uh oh bioshock collection so i was playing that so yeah that's going project x zone 2 tried to get into this uh could not it has phoenix right my boy phoenix right but uh couldn't get into it. Uh, it's not really my type of game, even though I love Fire Emblem. So you, you, um, you figured that one out. But uh, I can sell this for around eleven bucks. That's how much the game goes for now. This game looks like it would stay like around 20 30 bucks for a long time, but this dropped real quick. 
So, and I got it when it was like 20 or 25. So, yeah, I'm taking a hit on it. But I played it. So, Arkham VR. Uh, I played this twice, so I didn't. Uh, I'm done. They're selling for 12, so or they're asking for 12, so or whatever you know what I meant. And the last one is Pure Chess, which I got for a dollar at like a yard sale. So this is like eight dollars. So I'm going over that. So that's it. So that's just a quick little vid. Just, just a quick little vid, you know. Here's some. Here you go. Here's a quick recap of all the games I'm selling there. And then of course you got the two disc, pretty much disc only games. And then of course the two controllers. Uh, I estimate this at around 180. So pretty good considering it's a lot of stuff I don't play or haven't played or I'm not gonna play anymore. Um, I'll probably take more of a hit on this, but to be fair, I usually do this when I get stuff from Black Friday, and if, if I'm like done playing it or I'm not really caring for it, I usually sell it back on Amazon or eBay. Like I'm I'm probably gonna get XCOM 2 on consoles. That's 30 bucks at GameStop. I'm sure after the sales are done, it'll go back to like being 40 or $50 you could sell it for on Amazon or eBay. So if I don't like it or whatever, I go and sell it. So there you go. That's all the stuff I'm selling. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you. And until next time, goodbye. I'm going to go get me, well, I'm not getting it now, but I'm going to go get me credit. And then I'm going to get Pokemon on Friday and it comes out. It's come out Friday or next Friday. Uh, whatever. Whenever it comes out. So anyway, there you go. Thank you and goodbye.